So now what we'll do is we'll have an orientation for the history optional. I'll speak some points about the history optional. I'll give an outline about the history optional. I'll give an introduction for do's and don'ts about the history options. As you all know, the UPSC has got optional paper. And the UPSC has given one optional paper for us in the mains. In history, <coughs> we have our again I told you two papers we are having history, one is paper 1 we are having in the history optional, second we are having paper 2, history optional we are having paper 1, paper 2. See I told you history means it includes uh, four important components consist of the history optionals. One, is we have in ancient India. Second component we have medieval India, medieval India. Third component we are having modern India. Fourth we are having world history, four components. And each and every paper is divided into two, two sections. So, ancient India is section A, medieval India is section B, paper 1, modern India is section A, paper B, uh, section uh, A, paper 2, world history is section B, paper 2. There is a clear cut compartmentation of each and every sections. This is only available to the history optional, rest of the optionals is not available. The problem with other optional and history if you see, in history optional if you are if you're good at ancient India you can easily attempt section A. Because section A questions are not going to be asked in paper 2, paper 1 question is not, but in other optional let us say for example geography option if you take, geography, geomorphology question which is in the section A of the paper 1 can also be somehow connected to paper, paper 2 of geography. Geomar, because I'm, I had geography also as an option, I am telling. I studied geography and history both as my options. Okay. Similarly, cyclones, which forms a part of the paper 1 section A in geography, the questions can appear in paper 2 also connecting. Okay. So, this is a problem for us. But here in history, ancient India means only ancient India question. That means, if you are not good at one area, you can be very happy that that area is not going to affect your other area. Like ancient India, theory, ancient India, matta na ungul theory, matta dalang ko na mark kongla. Geography apdi illa. Yena ko ande climate allergy yena kujhe poora er karna paper ona matta ande badi kya the paper two yon ande badi kya the. Prince lang ungul ke. So this one advantage you are having in history optional. And sir, as I told you, history has got the second advantage also. What? Now, in each and every section, there are four questions 1, 2, 3, 4, again 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay? We are having 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Questions are there. 8 questions are there. paper. The instruction is very, very simple. I told you already. 5 questions you have to write. Each question is 50 marks. So, totally 250 marks for one paper, one any one paper. And the 5 questions has to be chosen how they are given instruction. Question number 1, question number 5 is compulsory. Question number 1, question number 5 is compulsory. Then in other section, you have to minimum choose one more question. Let us say any one question you can choose. Question number 3, question number 6 you can choose. Now, we have one more question to write. That one question you can choose from either ancient India or medieval India. Ancient India or medieval India. So, let us say I am good in ancient India, I will attempt. If I am good in medieval India, I can attempt one more question. Okay? So, if you are good in one area, you have the option of writing these three, but in other options it is not so, because you do not know whether that question from the area is going to come in that paper or not. Okay? Third point. Let us come to the third point. The third point is something which is called a map question. Map. Map consists of 50 marks in the history optional. 
it is a compulsory question it is a first question actually in map 20 locations would be given how the map would be asked is that you have to know what location is located where you have to plan for this for example lothal i told you lothal where it is located gujarat which part of the gujarat for example now how they are giving in the optional they give an indicate they give an hint they say ivc site in gujarat already they marked the site map questions how it will be i'll speak separately about the map okay if you have gujarat maps of say example here there is a site they will mark this this is number one they have given and in the question paper they have given the map okay they have given the map and they have said first location port site port ivc site so in the other port site ivc site in the answer sheet you have to write okay answer is lothal not only that identification of the site off mark off mark means 5 marks totally for this 20 20 locations how many marks 50 marks 2 and half marks for each and every location so in the 2 and half one mark for identification of the location correct identification one mark full mark is given then the next one and half mark for what one and half mark for writing some content about the lothal so you can write three to four points lothal just bulletin forms you can write just time is saved map question not advantage in a time saving mark fetching so you can write point you can write an artificial dockyard evidence of cylindrical seal it is a market center Every house has a well. Something you can write, no? Industrial solution. Four point. You can write that. So we can write four points. So for writing all the twenty locations, here the word is there. You all time ago. Or right to parking. Ingor side to parking. Engai no. Kanya Kumari no. So you are writing twenty words. Each word will give you one mark. And not only that, writing four four points or three points about each and every location is going to give you rest of the point. So if you are good at map. Out of 50 marks in the map, out of 50 marks in the map, if you even do, let us say, 17 sites properly, 17 sites, okay, let us calculate each and every site I am getting. Rand mark da or the moon site in a three way three other. Me the yellame podne le pota site in a full mark a kuruka vandana chkonga, okay, full mark let us say not given. Ilana ipudi edupo. 10 sites, 15 sites are marked, 10 sites I have written well, so 10 into 2.5, 10 sites. Let us say rest of the 7 sites I have identified well, but I have not given content, kunja content over mark over point conversion. Let us say I am getting just 2 marks, so calculate how much marks we are getting. So 10 into 2.5 is 25 marks, 7 into 2 14, okay, 39 marks. Now, in a bonita, moon location, Suttama Terila, Yelduvel Patu location and Allah Terri, the Eldi Mark Punish. Me the Yale location, Aragore Eldirka. Pretty long look. So, thirteen in marks out of fifty is what percentage? Now, Ruba considered estimate the Putraga. Okay, how much percentage is this? So, seventy eight percentage. I is one hundred Katharan percentage there were. 50 percentage in the means. Adhana wo munadi slide la pato. How much mark you are getting? So, yarnu tamaduk nur mark wangra hai, is wangra ma. Yathana percentage jide. GS la. Paper only ma out of 250 is getting 100 only. What percentage is this? How much is this? 40 percentage. 40 percentage. Okay. Yes, how much percentage is getting? Let us say he is getting around. Uh, SL on the Nuthi with Mark Gordon is Konga. For 250 is getting somebody put this into 100 means GS 100 out of 250. What percentage is getting? 40 percentage. Okay. SA. Let us say is getting 113 of Konga. That is the highest mark. SL on Nuthi with Okay. 130 for 250. What percentage is this? Into 100 put my all are there. 70 optional let us say is getting 270 
out of 500 what percentage is this anjali divide pannunga 270 eh? 54 i think 270 300 kuda vechukonga 270 nu vechukonga 275 illa 280 kuda vechukonga average marks 270 to 300 let us keep a mean let us say 280 280 means how much percentage is this 500 56 percentage here yeah, 56 percentage now map question 39 out of 50 what percentage is this 70 ah special purida in the science when the mathematics are number approach for the history with the in the 78 percentage where in the option in the option the army in the road mark on the map question long mark so map question if you do well paper on your mark will increase princha okay so is either this is the second advantage i'm comparing gs score is all this is for your comparison okay this is for your comparison so in history option i am telling map question gives you a great advantage but you have to plan for this so history i have given how many advantages have you given for history number one syllabus i have given no compartmentation compartmentation number two okay map question i told you Number three, another very very important thing about uh, history is that uh, repetition. You take the previous ten year question paper in history, any ten year question, ten years question paper. Topics would be questions would be asked only from five six areas. Indus, for example, in the ancient India, if you take IVC question will come. Vedic one question will come, Maurya's one question will come, Gupta's will be there, maximum Sangam one question will come. You take any question paper, any question paper, questions would repeat from only these areas. IVC na origin or in a decline or Vedic na early Vedic period, later Vedic period. Maurya say, Maurya's what a Dhamma policy or So, number of times a question is repeating, no other option you will have repeating questions. If you want, I can put that also. Exact verbatim question. World is repeat. Unification of Germany, Bismarck's role. Do you think that Bismarck is responsible for the unification of Germany? Rise of Napoleon. What are the contributions of Napoleon? Rise of Napoleon not over a point is the contribution of Napoleon. All points, the topics will be so repetitive that you can easily hit at what are those questions. So, another point for the history is repeated topics. <coughs> next advantage of history optional, what is the next advantage of the history optional is that uh, compare between the GS and the history optional, GS syllabus, okay, preliminary, ancient India, medieval India, modern india means world history correct history optional same ancient medieval modern world no change in syllabus understand idikum idikum or vithyas enna na history optional slightly deeper wider slightly not too much deeper or too much wider slightly deeper slightly wider you are understanding this now so even if you are not a history optional student you have to read all the gs and if you are history optional student all this is saved evening padikave thevala gs that's time is saved for you so much time your non history student vandu world history vechi urti irupan la question kekrangala illiya gs la world history ki but padichi thagana valiye kediyadu the time and how much questions in the preliminary is contributing 15 to 20 questions in the preliminary this you can do without studying the gs if you are history optional or if you are a gs student with history optional gs student mathe history optional padikamiye history optional 220 mark edukumudiyum 220 he can get just with the gs history knowledge 
he is attempting any history question 200 220 anybody can get rest of the 100 marks to improve i mean increase only we have to slightly go deeper we have to slightly go wider okay so this is one secondly second point okay yes sir the course question which you are getting now gandhi's course subhash chandra bose course nehru's course they are all history from history only it is taken history is going to contribute to you all the quotes sir interview i need not have to tell you interview if you are having historical depth of knowledge you are going to be definitely have an edge in the interview adu mathalla sir interlinking topics irukudla interlinking topics what are the interlinking topics for example history versus internal security background post independence consultation if you know internal security you will understand history polity linked topics connected to polity history how history and the constitution all the developments are there history environmental issues how historically environment question have been asked already so the whole syllabus issue as far as uh, okay here gs uh, preliminary plus mains interview essay all history is going to contribute the knowledge in history are we and uh, interlinking of the topics also i told you <coughs> interlinking interlinking of topics also i told you okay and the last important point if you see i can go on speaking about the history points the last important point if you see just you have to do a limited syllabus limited you can get you can complete the paper limited you need not have to read everything in the syllabus everything the syllabus leaves seems very big the syllabus also if you see the vastness of the syllabus if people are seeing for example ivc origin rise decline so either point either point they are giving vedic they speak about society polity culture economy sir mauryas society polity so they are defining all this guptas society polity sir delhi sultanates society polity purincha ungalke endha topic edathala idella repeat pannite irupan so the topics look so vast and exhaustive but it is nothing just one if you read one part it is covered everything is systematically covered you are understanding this so history has all this advantages vast advantages it is having so reading history is not difficult and uh, many people have said sir data nanga eppadi nyam vekkirudhu you are going to see no data is going to be used in the history optional paper gs as well as optionals no dates i am not going to give unnecessary dates it is not required less data we have to remember that much data you are remembering for polity paper that much data you are remembering for economy endha evlo economic data ninga yabakireengala adoda kammi da history yabakke poringa polity endha lok articles number yabakireengala adoda data kammi da yabakke poringa so basically history has got all this advantages all this advantages so if you really plan and you can master this history history ku innum romba periya advantage onnu irukudhu yaarkume theriyadhu or advantage okay marks irukudhalla no variation matha option la bayangaramana variation irukku mark or main seldringa let us say option number x okay 250 mark vaangringa mains one la okay adutha varsham main seldringa 170 vandrum ungalku yenna theriyadhu ungalku history poruth varaikum definitely your marks will never reduce yaar vena history option eduthavanga eludunga ஒரு ஒரு மெயின்ஸ் குன்னொரு மெயின்ஸ் மார்க் இன்க்ரீஸ் ஆகுமே தவிர மார்க் குறைஞ்சாத சரித்திரமே கிடையாது தேர் மார்க்ஸ் ஓன்லி வில் பி இன் ஹையர் வே பட் வி ஹவ் பீப்புள் ஹூ ஆர் கெட்டிங் சர்வீஸ் ஆல்சோ இன் அதர் ஆப்ஷனல்ஸ் ஹூஸ் மார்க் த்ரீ ஹண்ட்ரட் வாங்கினவங்களே டூ ஹண்ட்ரட் வாங்கியிருக்காங்க ஆப்ஷனில் மற்ற ஆப்ஷனில் அடுத்த அட்டம்ட்டு எனக்கே அது புரியல ஏன் இவ்வளோ கம்மியாக மார்க் வாங்குறாங்கன்னு சொல்லிட்டு நல்லா படிச்சனால தானே த்ரீ ஹண்ட்ரட் வாங்கணும் போன டைமு அடுத்த டைம் முன்னே நல்லா படிச்சிருப்பாங்க தானே அப்போ த்ரீ ஹண்ட்ரட் ப்ளஸ் தானே வாங்கணும் ஏன் அப்படி வாங்கலனா அது எனக்கு அந்த அந்த ஆப்ஷனலோட நேச்சர் அப்படி இருக்குதுன்னு நான் நினைக்கிறேன் பட் ஹிஸ்ட்ரி அப்படி கிடையாது 
yaar neenga paathukittinga munadi always they will have the maintenance of that standard they will never come down but they may increase possibility of increase is there so all these advantages we are having for the st option purinchilla ungalukku so this is the point i want to say about the st optional any doubt now before you go to the next any doubt you are having any doubt pakka ac konjam on pannunga irunadhu switch on the ac okay so first for st optional what are the materials we will see materials materials what are the materials we have to read first material first important thing is my class don't ever compromise on the class because what i speak in 2 hours is what i learned in 3 months purudilla 2 maasam 3 maasam 4 maasam padicha nariya varshangal compile panna vishayatha i am going to speak in 2 hours class so idha neenga vandu or or class miss panninga na 2 manar miss panna pala naatkaloda vishayam miss pannitinga na artham adhu ellarkume purundum okay number 2 class plus class notes number 2 sometimes i give dictated notes also in the class i dictate notes sometimes sometimes okay dictation dictation notes i give in the class those notes are very important because sometimes i will dictate notes also sila time vandu sila topics ku enak pesnadhu poga unne edha nachu na solluvenu nanna pa சில டாபிக் நான் ஒன்றும் பேசியிருக்க மாட்டேன் ஏன்னா பேசுறதுக்கு ஒன்றும் இல்லை பட் ஏதாச்சும் ஒரு கண்டென்ட்டு ஃபார் எக்ஸாம்பிள் பக்தி மூமெண்ட் சுஃபி மூமெண்ட்லாம் எவ்வளோ தான் பேசினாலும் ஒரு அஞ்சு பாயிண்ட் நம்மளுக்கு எழுதணும் வி ஹவ் டு ரைட் திஸ் ஃபைவ் சிக்ஸ் பாயிண்ட்ஸ் ஐ வில் டிக்டேட் திஸ் நோட்ஸ் ஓகே தேர்ட் ஆஸ்பெக்ட் தர் இஸ் சம்திங் விச் இஸ் கால்ட் அ ப்ரிண்டட் மெட்டீரியல் விச் இஸ் கிவன் இன் த இன்ஸ்டிடியூட் விச் இஸ் இந்த புக்ஸ் இன்ஸ்டிடியூட் புக்ஸ் தெர் ஆர் சிக்ஸ் புக்ஸ் விச் ஆர் கிவன் ஓகே ஏன்ஷியன்ட் medieval modern world map plus culture okay six material i have given for history option you already enrolled i think all the six material would have been given to you okay this six fourth n c e r t the ncert can be come here or the third material can come here this is up to you adu ungalude choice adu neenga ncert padichu material padikalam ye material padichu ncert padikalam so there stops the history material list avladha no other thing is required purudile idiyo meeri nare per enak idu mudichta idu mudikama vera material po kuda this is the order first is the class second is the dictated notes third is the ncert or the printed material fourth is the rest revised you don't need to do anything else in history option sir illa sir na konjam nariya na edho padikinu nenikira book suggest pannunga na or paper a4 sheet paper eduthu vaanga ena paarunga na dictate pandra purinjilla idha mudichadukapra na varanum adhu idhu mudikkaame vandinga na rendu a4 sheet eduthu vaanga purinjilla idhiyum mudikkaama நீங்க பண்ண கூடாது சார் இதை நான் கம்ப்ளீட் பண்ணிட்டே இருக்கேன் பேரலாம் வேற ஏதாவது புக்ஸை படிக்கலாம்னா எனி ஒன் புக் ஐ வில் சஜஸ்ட் ஃபார் ஏன்ஷியன் இந்தியா ஒன் மோர் புக் டெக்ஸ்ட் ஐ வில் சஜஸ்ட் மிடிவல் ஒன் மோர் ஐ வில் சஜஸ்ட் மாடர்ன் ஒன் தட்ஸ் இட் பட் அதெல்லாம் இப்போ நான் சஜஸ்ட் பண்ணல தேவையில்ல நம்மளுக்கு திஸ் ஒன்லி வில் டூ இஸ் ஹிஸ்ட்ரி மெட்டீரியல் அண்ட் யூ டு கான்ஸ்டன்ட்லி ரீட் அண்ட் ரீட் அண்ட் ரீட் கிளாஸோட சேர்ந்து இன்னும் ரொம்ப ரொம்ப முக்கியமான விஷயம் என்னன்னா விச் கம்ஸ் இன் பிட்வீன் திஸ் கிளாஸ் இஸ் மை டெஸ்ட் டிஸ்கஷன் டெஸ்ட் டிஸ்கஷன்ஸ் ஹண்ட்ரட் பர்சன்டேஜ் யூ ஹாவ் டு அடன் மை டெஸ்ட் டிஸ்கஷன்ஸ் யூ ஹவ் டு ரைட் த டெஸ்ட் யூ ஹவ் டு அடன் த டெஸ்ட் டிஸ்கஷன்ஸ் இஃப் யூ ஆர் மிஸ்ஸிங் த டெஸ்ட் டிஸ்கஷன் த வேல்யூ அடிஷன் உட் நாட் பி பாசிபிள் கிளாஸ் வில் கிவ் யூ த ஃபவுண்டேஷன்ஸ் கிளாஸ் நோட்ஸ் அண்ட் மை டிக்டேஷன்ஸ் வில் கிவ் ஃபவுண்டேஷன் ப்ளஸ் டெஸ்ட் டிஸ்கஷன்ஸ் இஸ் கோயிங் டு கிவ் யூ த மார்க்ஸ் வேல்யூ அடிஷன் மார்க்ஸ் டெஸ்ட் டிஸ்கஷன் அடன் பண்ணலனா முப்பது மார்க் எக்ஸ்ட்ரா வரவே வராது because all finer points i am going to speak only in the test discussion in the class i will not speak purudilla yen class la pesa mudiyadna adalla romba finer points adu class la namba pesadhukku space irukad in the class we will go the major trend only okay so these are the history study material list idha thavara vera edhume thavakadiyadu 
okay next duration of the course how much duration do you think that i have to take a course okay you calculate yourself for ancient india i require around 20 classes if you, even if it goes slow also i require 20 classes which is including map also ancient india plus map medieval india i require about 20 classes about it may be 18 to 20 18 to 20 modern india i require 20 to 25 classes world history i require about 20 to 25 classes or 20 classes so totally total number of classes would be 80 to 90 classes plus test you have to write all my test which are basically i am keeping around 28 test which is a part of the course 28 test which will be spread to one year duration the test is for one year duration this is one year test duration i will integrate you into the test but you have to write this test integrated into the test so the test duration you have to write and this 80 to 90 classes with the classes test one year duration how the classes will be there when the classes will be over how many months it will be over so weekly i will take how many classes four to five classes i will take weekly per week four to five classes monday tuesday wednesday thursday i will take these are the four additional classes either i will take on if i have if i have to take i will take on friday or sometimes saturday or sunday i will take but very rare saturday and sundays because we have other classes also so four to five classes every week i will take so you divide 85 classes into four how many weeks it is coming how many weeks pa embathanje naal adu pirichu avlo pa 21 varam da 21 weeks no divided by four maasam four and half to five months is the course duration ma pirinchu ungalku sir from where i am going to start next no next question from where you will start sir from where I have to start. We will start from ancient, medieval, modern, world. Okay. 